What is up guys, GameServeToast.com here. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a free public uh, Team Fortress uh, server. First off, you want to download and unpack Steam CMD from the store. Um, there's a link in the description bar on how to do this. Then you run that program here. If it doesn't work, you want to close your Steam. Um, in my case, it should work just fine. Then you want to log in, anonymous. And then you want to use a command called force install here. And then to the location you want it installed. In this case, I'm just going to make a folder on my C drive for it to install on. Um, next up is the app update. App update. And then on their website, there's also a link in the description bar. Um, you can find all sorts of uh, IDs for servers to download and in this case it's 232250 and then validate this is um, gonna start downloading all the files and I'll be back as soon as it's finished once the installation is complete you wanna go to your install directory right click on the SRCDS application and then you wanna drag it onto somewhere else create a shortcut. I want to put in this hyphen console hyphen game tf hyphen port and this is the port if you have multiple servers you might want to change this but in this case it's just the default 27015. Then we want to put in max players. This can be anything but in this case I'm going to put it to 24. And then you want to do plus map and I am going to go for ctf underscore to port and apply and ok then you want to go into your tf and cfg folder open up your favorite text editor here and you want to put in these um, this script here a lot of script these settings um, go to file save as and then you want to go to computer local disk tf or depending on where you installed it go to cfg then all types and type in server.cfg now um, this is where you would change the host name this there is a lot of uh, stuff that can be put in here but for our simple server this should be enough Close it down, go to the SRCDS shortcut, and double click. It might seem like there's errors in it, and I'm just going to hide the window because it's going to show my public IP address. Now, if you want to make this a public IM server, you want to go to run, type in CMD, type in IP config, scroll up here. And right here is this IPv4 address. This is your LAN address. Open up the router settings for your router. In this case, uh, this is my one right here. Want to add a new rule? Start port and end port should be 27015. Both protocols and the server IP is, of course, your LAN IP. 12. Apply. Then you just want to restart the server maybe disable your firewall on the windows but I'm not sure um, also the router may need a restart depending on your manufacturer but let's just go check and if it's online here and there we go this is my server right here it should be public people should be able to join it um, using friends list and the server list so yeah thanks for watching